Hello and good afternoon. This is Ute from Ute's Herbal Witch Corner. And before we're starting, you know, would you please like, comment, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you so much. So today I'm talking about licorice. And I have to apologize because all of my other videos I always say licorice. So be patient with me. Um, I know the German words, but the English words, especially in the medicine, I have to learn to pronounce them properly. So it's called licorice. licorice. So licorice is an herb, a root you can use in different kind. You can use them as capsules and you can use them as a tincture and you can also, and I just found this out, you can also enjoy a cup of tea. So licorice, tea, and may you know the name licorice, you can even get this as a candy. In Germany it's mostly black and it's not everybody's taste but you can get it as a candy as well. Licorice is called in Germany Süßholzwurzel, which is easier to talk to me or get over my tongue than licorice. But as I said, licorice is the right pronunciation. Here I have licorice as a capsule and I also have licorice as a tincture without alcohol. So, this is the licorice, <laughs> licorice root and this is the powder when I take it out of my grinder. The tea looks like this. Beautiful color. I never ever tried it so the reaction you will have is life now. So let me try it. Not really any smell. Wow, it's sweet, extremely sweet, I have to say. For me, it's a little bit too sweet. And the taste is a little bit like licorice. So not as strong as you would take or eat the candy, but you can taste the licorice. It is sweet. May I have to get used to it? Yeah, still too sweet for me, but it's healthy. Let's talk about licorice. Uh, licorice root extract, which is this here, um, is known for an antipasmodic effect on the stomach and the intestines. It's regulating the acid and also help to protect the mucous membranes in the stomach. So to explain it to me, Ken, my husband, he is having since years, and when I say years, I'm talking about 40 years plus, issue with acid reflux. And years ago, he had an operation in Germany because it was so bad and they could kind of fix it, but they say it will be something he has more or less to live with. So he has to be very, very careful what he is eating. And he was for years on medication over the counter for acid reflux or even from the doctor. And now we tried a couple different herbs which would benefit his acid reflux, reflux. And we found finally an herb slash root that helps him. And this is licorice. He is taking, since a couple of days now, the licorice capsule. 
and he is taking one per day and so far and he's taking it as I said since a couple of days he has no acid reflex at the moment and he is eating not a special diet or anything he's eating whatever he wants to eat because it sounds bad but he's used to it um, but this licorice capsule seems to be really really helpful for him I also made licorice tincture and I made them without alcohol so it's a glycerin tincture and with the glycerin tincture you take the drop and I will show you this you take one dropper three times per day and with the tincture you always take it before you have your meal your breakfast your dinner your supper so a half an hour before so when we say one dropper i just want to show you that because it's irritating the dropper is really really big and when we are talking about one dropper you push it you so you squeeze it and this is then one dropper and this is what you are taking three times per day if you're using the tincture. Also, you can use, as we tried it together, you can use and drink the tea. Again, very, very, very sweet. Too sweet for me. But maybe it's in an, an good taste for, for the children because it is sweet. May I put it, some ice cubes in it and I try it cold again, but like it is right now, it's too sweet and I'm not lying to you. It's too sweet for my own taste. So in um, addition, the ingredients also have an anti-inflammatory effect. So this means it helps your stomach, your gut, um, or G-E-R-D, that means all the um, issues you can have with your tummy, with your acid reflux, um, IBS and all this um, issues you can have within your G-E-R-D. -E so please read it because uh, this is, uh, I cannot know, that's why I blended it in so you know what I'm talking about. Um, Licorice is a perennial um, herbaceous plant, so that means she is growing um, at least two, three, four years. And as I um, educated you with using roots from the plant, you always have to let her grow for at least two years. And in the th uh, third year, you can start harvesting partial of the roots so the roots and then dry the roots and then grind them if you need it as a powder or as i said here you can use this uh, the roots the dry roots and make a tea for yourself but as i said it's extremely sweet the plant will be when she is growing out at least 150 centimeters, one made one meter and 50 centimeters. Um, I don't even know what it is in inches. Um, the licorice root um, has a mixture of potassium and cal calcium salt of glyceric acid. All those fancy names. So, in other words, there is some kind of uh, glycerin in it and if you are allergic or you have any issues with um, glyceric you should not take licorice tincture licorice capsules or you should not drink licorice tea there is a study that found out that the licorice root to be more eff effective at reducing the symptoms of acid reflux than 
the pills you can buy over the counter like Tums, Pepto, Rolites, um, and the test was the study was going over two years. So there are tests made with the licorice root and they are really helping with acid reflux um, enormous. There are more than one herb you can use for acid reflux, especially, but licorice has the best results. And as I said, Ken is showing that he is reacting to the benefits of licorice and he is totally happy. I will keep you updated um, on the benefits over a longer time. But as from as far as today, he is helpful and thankful for licorice. But as I said, I will keep you updated. You can get, that's what I said, you can get licorice here as a capsule, as a tincture, or you can, if you like the sweetness, you can make yourself a tea out of it, okay? And maybe you realize, look at this, it's bright and I don't have to put on the torch slash flashlight because we got our lights and yeah, we're trying to be um, more professional so it's enjoyable for you to see our education videos, all right? So this was for today, talking about licorice and the licorice tincture, licorice herbs, capsules, and the tea. You can get everything what I'm talking right now in my shop. I'm here um, seven days a week from noon to 5 p.m. Or if you want to call me, you can come whenever I'm at home or not sleeping because of my night shift, and I will definitely open the store for you. All right? So, yeah, 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 you're waiting for it. I know it. <laughs> um, yeah, you know it, but I have to say it for my own liability. Um, I'm not your doctor. I will not and I cannot take, give you any medical advice. All my information I'm sharing here with you are from my own experience, my husband's friends, family, clients. So it is 100% not any medical advice I'm giving to you. You, If you have any issue with um, heartburn or any question, if you can use licorice, may you want to talk to your doctor and he will give you a medical advice. But if you trust me as your master herbalist, I can share and I will my experience and as you realized, I'm not covering anything. I clearly told you this tea is too sweet for me, but it's helpful. But I have no acid reflex. So, as always, the snow is on the way. So stay warm, stay healthy. And give me a call if you have any question. Shoot me a message. I'm here for you and will answer all your questions regarding special herbs benefiting you, all right? So, I wish you a beautiful rest of the day and enjoy the rest of the week. I will talk to you tomorrow. Um, as usual, I don't know about what, but we will find something. If you have any special question or you wanna hear anything about a special herb you heard about it, may you just put uh, a comment under this video and let me know so I can create an education video, um, especially for um, a herb which is interesting for you at the moment, all right? Other than this, I will say bye-bye, have a wonderful day. This was Ute, your local master herbalist. Bye-bye. Thank you.